So this is a tool we did for installing windows into a skid steer. I'm going to go ahead and show the ease of movement, proportional controls on the easy arm we have here. What we're doing here is coming off, gripping onto this. You'll notice that we have a vacuum gauge on here that once this hits green, it's safe to lift. Uh, it is a vacuum saving pump. So as soon as vacuum is made, the air consumption stops, checks the, checks the, the uh, cups, and if there's a leak or anything through the system, you'll hear the pump kick on. You know, in this case, it usually kicks on every one to two minutes. Uh, just a short puff of air, just to get enough air to get the vacuum going again. There's a time blow off on it as well, so when we hit the release button, uh, it will, it will uh, blow for about 10 seconds to help, help push the cups off the windshield. This is a non-porous part. We do have an anti-drop circuit here, so you cannot release this in mid-air, hit the release button right there. Uh, one of the things that really bought this unit for was float mode. So we'll tap this button here on this control handle, and now as opposed to, to actually using any of the controls, I can get up right next to the window, kind of give it a little bit of tilt, push it up and down, but really it's one finger control. This is probably a 50, 60 pound window, so very easy to maneuver. The easy arm itself, which you kind of see the overhead crane from back there, is really easy to move around to sell. I mean, I can take two fingers on this thing, one finger, and rotate this around the cell with no problem at all. I mean, it takes a minimal amount of force. Uh, the fact you have the articulated arm up there allows you to get right up next to your columns, so you get full use of your work cell without really having to put any extra force on the arm. Uh, we'll go ahead and set this down, we'll show the time blow off. There's your proportional controls, I can really feather this down or speed it up depending on what I want to do, but I'm just lightly setting it down here. Hit the release button, time to blow off and you're done.